Hi, boys and girls, it's Mrs. Brown again, and today is the third session of Junior Achievement for your class. I hope you're having a wonderful day. In today's session, we're going to talk about a couple different things. You're gonna learn what an entrepreneur is. I know it's kind of a big word. A producer and a consumer. You're also going to learn how an entrepreneur can contribute to a city. So you have a lot of great things that you'll learn today in this session. But first, what we will be talking about is businesses so that you can understand how businesses have to use all four money choices to be successful. Businesses are important to cities and to the people who live in those cities. And if businesses are doing really good, then people are getting jobs, people and businesses are spending money because they have money to spend, and money is being earned and flowing through the community. People and businesses then also have money to save and donate. So if you're spending money at a store, then now that store can give somebody a job and that money just keeps going through the community. It makes the community very healthy and makes it alive. Now let's talk about last session and what you learned at the last session. There were four choices that we talked about. Do you remember what those four choices were? We talked a lot about them. So why don't you take a moment to think about those four choices and what those choices were? Very good, very good. We also talked about different ways you can spend money. And we talked about different forms in which you can spend money. So for example, when you go to the grocery store or maybe when you perform a dog walk service, maybe it's a business that you have, what types of payment or what forms of payment or money or invisible money, invisible money, can we use when paying for those types of services? Okay, so I want you to think about that. And then the rest of the session, your teacher will talk to you about businesses and how people in those businesses spend money on goods and services. So while you talk with your teacher about those things, remember the four choices and also about the ways that we can spend money and also the ways the businesses can spend money on goods and services, then you'll have so much more knowledge about businesses, jobs, and money. So I will talk to you all at the next session, which is session number four. Have a great day. Bye-bye.